Hello, hello guys, welcome to episode number 14 of Double Trouble, where we're still rocking on with the steam. We'll be doing it for a little while yet. I, I actually don't really know how long. Um, but if you didn't check out last episode, I think you should, because we had a certain bird who was pretty okay. Did, did quite a bit of work, so hopefully we can we can get some good matches and we find one right away, so that's always great. Let's see what he's bringing. Let's bring a stack attack. Okay, that is that is not lovely. Um, so Galileo looks pretty nice. It looks pretty freaking nice. What does it take care of? Incineroar, and Toxic Rogue. I realize I don't have the best answer for Toxic Rogue, but we do have Articuno. We do have Articuno. Um, I'm feeling. Yeah, what am I feeling? I could see Incineroar Kyogre be a good lead. The only problem is if he has a Toxic Rogue, then we don't really have any way to really hit the Toxic Rogue. But we can fake out the Toxic Rogue. And um, we bring the Articuno. And the Sogaleo, I think. Bula is not really too great in this match. Mimikyu. Not really the best. We, we bring those four. What could possibly go wrong? That's the thing. Like, no, nothing, nothing's going wrong. It's everything it will be going perfectly. And you can see that on the camera. I mean, you can't because it would come off, but it annoyed my eyes, so I moved it. Great! <laughs> and here's a new cup of, cup, of, cup of tea. Well, just like be a winter tradition, and since it's winter here basically most of the year, that means it's basically like all year. Except for the summer, except if we get a cold summer. Okay, here at least these two. Okay. Somehow I feel like this is not like the greatest for him. Because I'm I'm sort of kind of feeling I know knocking off and clicking water spout and doing a lot of damage to something. Yeah, you draw that stack attack. I mean I can see the toxic rogue, yeah. This is the toxic rogue. Well it's fine. Um, it'd be nice to knock that off, but I would much rather kill the Lunala. It's it'll, it'll be it'll be great. Um, we might lose a Kyogre in the process, though. Um, that's why we have Sukaleo. Sukaleo still takes care of the Stack Attacker. Stack Attacker. Stack Attacker. I like that's a thing. Like I've never actually like real. I don't know fully how to pronounce it, and it's annoying me. But it's yeah, I can't be bothered. Can't be bothered. Stuck a tucker. Stuck a tucker. Stuck a tucker. Okay, so I kept talking into the very copyright claimed steam room, so uh, that probably cut off a weird place, but Lunala's dead and Kyogre's somehow still alive. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> oh, it's, it's going great. It's going great. I'm being honest, it's going so great. Okay. So this thing here is a problem. It is a problem. Um, and I'm not really feeling too great staying in. I feel like I kind of have to switch in. I mean, were you turning Cineroar? I'm going to switch in Sogaleo. In case I need to, like, kind of trick room something, which I could, uh, might be happening might be happening. This would be a case where like it wouldn't be great to click origin pulls instead. You just fake me out. Yeah, you can. Oh, okay. You just fake I'm so clear. That's okay. Not like that would have been the greatest for me, but um, that's the thing. He, he can trigger him. Oh, that was great. Oh, that did so much damage. That was crazy. Um, Another thing that I've actually considered for this team, and I haven't done it, it's so actually because of like putting the fighting MC on Sokaleo to like have a super powerful fighting attack and we don't know our stats and such. Haven't done it. Um, something missed. Oh, rip. I thought he would trick room. Okay. Um, okay. That is unfortunate. 
He could white guard. So I'm just going I'm going to scold him. And I'm going to Sun Steel Strike the the um Toxic Rogue. It would have been better if he'd hit in hit Sokaleo and missed that Kuna. That would have been great. But uh I, I, I was just so sure of, and yeah, I was also pretty sure of, yeah, but you have to attack instead, so it's fine. No reason to go for an Argent Bulls and risk missing when you can just scroll and everything's great and this thing won't get to heal. That's I feel like it's a slow toxic group. It's probably just bulky. It's probably just bulky. Oh well. No kick. Oh no, you got my Kauga. It's okay though. It's okay. We win it. We're in a point where it's like 2v2. So I think we're, we're pretty good. It's 2v2, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, not Asikuno. Asikuno died. Um, okay. Let's see. Because we can fake out. We can fake out. We, ha we have we have a nice and fake out. That we can do. And you have a Cernius. Okay. I think I will basically just fake out the Cernius. Kill the Toxic Rogue. I mean, he can protect, but it, it won't really help him in this case. So we just fake out Cernius. I mean, you can protect, and it's fine. But we just, we already know that we're fast on the Toxic Rogue with our Sokleo. So, yeah, yeah, you can protect. We can just also strike you next turn. It'll be great. Pure greatness. Pure greatness. Yeah, we still strike. Toxic Rogue gets down, because then we can just... Basically, flare blitz. And. Sun Steel Strike, and nothing can stop us. Because even if he gets to plus two, guess what? We still live a hit, so we are good. We are golden, baby. Even though Atikuna died a pretty horrible death to begin with, we are still golden. It's beautiful. That's what's for it. Okay. I will be back when we have a next opponent, so. Be right back. Okay, well, the next one is going super fast right now. It's lovely. Let us see. Kyogre, Sokaleo, Lele, Raichu, Ferrovon, and Cineral. This is not fun. <laughs> this is not the greatest, I will be honest. Um, I, I feel Sokaleo is a pretty good bring. Pretty good bring. Bula could be okay. It's not great though, but it's not awful. But it's not great. That's true, it's not great. Um it's general is a, a yes. Yes please, yes please. As a lead. Only thing that ruined that is the Kyogre. So we need something that destroys the Kyogre in a lead too. Also Galeo could be nice. Yeah, also Galeo is a is a must. Our so Galeo is a must. If I had a same, it would not be a bad. You know, indeed. Um, I need to decide. <laughs> I want to bring everything. I mean, the Kyogre is always good. Kyogre is always good. Maybe we just bring those. So we have Sokolai on the back. Do we bring Atikuna again? Or do we bring Bulu? Atikuna, Bulu. Atikuna, Bulu. Atikuna? No, I feel like I should bring Bulu. Can I? Can I? Can I? Okay, I got it. Wait a second. L last second. Last second. Um, hopefully, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. He has some creepy eyes. Also, I was considering putting this team out of QR code, but first of all, is there interest for it? Second, I should consider those changes and test it out and kind of see what works best. Because like Mimikyu. I feel like it's it, it's okay. It's not great, but it's okay. I, I I honestly just don't know what to put on instead. So Claire could be interesting. Um, okay. Okay. I I just stared at the screen and I did not notice which rain went up first. Um, that is unfortunate. And I can't electric move your Raichu. But you know what I can? I can fake out your Kyogre. And I can go into my Bulu. 
That that is something that I can do, yes. And it is what I will do, because we resist water, we resist electric, everything is good. I am like holding my cup very tight because this is um it's not the best lead, let's just say that it's not the best lead is not a good lead for us, but it's okay. Nothing's lost yet. Well, there's a Articuno, there's a way. Somehow. Not that I feel like we'll get into a lost situation where we have to rely on sheer cold, hopefully, but you know, it's a great move. Okay, but we get we get we get our little little bulu in. A little bulu. Let us see. Because you know it could just be a fake out water move, and yeah, you fake out. You fake out my incineral, so my incineral cannot fake out, so we deal origin balls. Okay, I think incineral's dead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is okay. That's too. That, that's a bit unfortunate. Um, Raichu doesn't get fell on me, right? No, I don't believe it should. Um, okay. Maybe like water reducing berry instead of all. I don't know. Like, I kind of miss having protect on it for these cases. Um, right now, I'm sort of really considering setting up a trick room. And I feel like I will. Do you have a switch into grass? Yes, you actually do. I don't feel like you're going to stay in because you can't really kill me. It would be brave. It would be brave. Are you a draw? Okay. So it was, it was a good thing to hit the... Um, the other thing is dead, and we unfortunately don't have anything on Sokaleo to... Oh. Yeah, see, that's kind of why a C-move could be great, I feel like. But I mean, we get a trick room up, so it's something. It's something. I wonder if... If we nature this madness, his Sogaleo. Can the superpower from our Sogaleo kill it? I feel like it won't, but I, I, I am kind of... I feel like I have to be hopeful anyway, basically. Because I don't have the best way to break this when uh, Incident was dead. Maybe go see Bimik instead of Ferret. No, because that would ruin the whole purpose, because it's to counter evil tone, not to counter Sogaleo. True. So like just a shadow claw would be good. Um, we'll see. Let us see. Let us see. Because like right now, like Raichu is just kind of there, and we did not miss. Beautiful. 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 <laughs> I just, I just feel like it won't do enough. It didn't. Oh dang it. But you didn't eat a berry either, so that's that's nice. Actually, I think Bulu's dead. No, you just trick room again. Okay. So you trick room, I trick room. So we just all trick room. Okay. 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 So we attack the Sogaleo and we also just attack the Raichu and we just hope that everything turns out alright. I guess. Must be the strategy. Because I... I uh, because if there's a Sunset Strike coming... Chikuno can't hit it. Did I bring Kyoga? Yeah, I did. I mean, Kyogre could eat it, but it wouldn't be great, and I feel like we can still need Delph, because if he is crafting, we are crafting. It will just be a mess, but let's see. We are both in a in a tricky spot. Tricky spot. Focus Blast! I mean, yes, I... Oh, my Bulu? You really want to kill the Bulu. 
You really don't like my Bulu. What has my Bulu ever done to you? I don't understand the focus pass, but okay, okay. It's um, not great, but you also glow is dead too. So, I mean, ours is a minus two, that's not exactly great, and we are basically facing destruction. Um, I mean, so Glow can kill a. So Glow can kill the Raichu. No, you're not down to because I never took out your Kyogre. Why do I always think that? No, I think we're at a pretty rough spot, to be honest. <laughs> we are at a very rough spot. I don't think I'm coming out of this one. Don't think we're coming out of this one. I think losing Incineroar turn 1 was kind of a... Um, kind of iffy. Um, but yeah. It's okay. It's okay. At least we got the first one. We will... Oh, we will have a third battle too. And I forgot to do that. Dang. I need to remember to stop the camera. between. And yes, his Kyogre is faster than my Kyogre. I mean, does it really? Hmm. I mean, I have to superpower your Kyogre, and I have to basically lock myself into Origin Pulse because I'm going to be taking damage, and I can't hit the Raichu. Basically, this what must happen. Oh, my Kyogre is faster, and I miss your Kyogre, but at least your Raichu is dead. I mean, this is not a speed side. That would be weird if it was. You just scold. Okay. Don't burn me. Okay, you didn't. Can I crit? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. The rain stops. Oh, this is great. Nice. Okay. No more grass. I would have loved to hit your Kyogre while there was still rain up. That would have been great. You have a Lele. And if you're a Lele Scarf, it's going to hurt me quite a bit. You're not. You have that. So I will Sunsteel Strike you. Because I feel like I have to. And I will just Origin Pulse. Because I feel like if we end a Night Kyogre against Kyogre match... We could be okay, um, but against both of these, uh, that's not going to be right. Uh, we are Pulse, we land both this time, okay, okay. Would have been nice if there was rain and Layla is living now. Yeah, that did absolutely nothing. There's no rain, live. Prop the berry, prop the berry. You prop the berry. No. Oh yeah, I got it knocked off. Oh, that's true. That's unfortunate. I forgot I lost the berry. And we don't really have a chance. Um, okay. I mean, we will still play it out. Maybe we get two mega crits. <laughs> and that would be, you know, something. Like, if we could crit Lele, then we, we might have some sort of chance. I'm holding my breath on it. Is it not good job? Nope. Not even close. Yeah, you just scold it and then we die. Sigh, Shirk, and everything is peachy. You get absolutely no burns. We don't burn in this part of town. He's still living. Okay, we have one more turn. If we could get a crit. Crit? Crit? Are we getting a crit? Can we get a crit? Nope, because we miss. <laughs> oh, well. I mean, we got a crit, just not on the Pokemon that we needed, so... Okay, okay, scaring down. He held his ground, though. He did help hold his ground very well. Um, well. I'll be back when we have the third opponent, so be right back. Okay, last one of the day. I'm not even going to try and pronounce that name. You have a ho-oh. 
Like, two Pokemon says, hey, Kyogre, the rest is kind of like, don't, don't, no. The bug is interesting, though. You know what doesn't look too bad? It's Kuno. Kuno looks pretty okay. Um, is it all not the worst thing I've seen either? I mean, Incineroar never looks bad in a matchup, I guess. Um, but um, yeah, okay, so Incineroar. What will your problem be? It thinks like a Kyogre or a Buck. How do I take care of those? I lead my own Kyogre and click Thunder. Um, so Kaleo, I don't feel it's too great here. Articuno is a bring, yes. The only thing I'm having issue with, like looking at this, is Ferrothorn. Which might punish me and actually very heavily makes me do this instead. Just because I don't want to lose to Ferrothorn. In case, like, because, like, if we don't, if the rain is up, then Flavor is going to do nothing, and we are going to have problems, and it's, it'll just be great. Um, but Mercury did look decent, though. Did look decent for some of it to just, like, get a huge hit off and do some damage to this purple boy. Very purple boy. Okay. We leave these two. It's getting, like, kind of signature ways. Go laser butt and your own Kyogre. Well, you can first impression me. That doesn't flinch, right? No, I don't think it does. I, I, I've never used this thing. I've never faced this thing. I don't really know what it does other than being a buck. Um, but I fake out and I click Thunder on the goodies apart because it's, it's unpleasant to me that it's in here. Um, we can Thunder the other one the next turn, so it could be, it could be okay. It could be okay. Let's just say it like that. I'm pretty sure Golisabot should be less bulky than Kyogre. I think first impression. It does? No, okay, it, it didn't. Your scarf too. And you live, but you're out. I don't like that this is my rank goes up first and then you're faster, no. Like, speed time for this? That's just weird. I mean, you are pressuring me quite a bit. Also, I feel like there's a nice electric move coming out. Onto my Kyoga. Um, but I think I, I'll knock off the Hobo and I will click Panda on the Koga because I want to kind of, you know, if it's a speed sandwich, I don't know what that is, but did my rain go first? Or was it his rain? We live, okay. We Panda your Kyoga. Like my Koga is pretty bulky. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's it's weird to me. Like, right now I'm a bit weirded out. Okay, you're fast now. It's great. I mean, it's not, but you don't have your barrier anymore. Which at least does, ma it does make me feel a bit better about life. And I think I just want to kill the Kyoka, basically. Um, it, it is a, um, it's a nuisance to my eye. You would draw your Kyoga. But then at least we get a knockoff off. So we kill your Galistapod. Your Brave Bird. I mean, you are a Brave Bird. But I am sure I'm an alive cat. Yes. Which means that I knock off your Ho-Ho again. Why are you letting my Kyoga live? I, I I don't fully understand. Want to be like this or something different, maybe? Could make sense. Um, 
Because, I mean, now, now a water move kills, basically. Um, do I have something that can switch into a water move? I mean, it'll have to be on an origin pulse. I think we go to Galeo. We click that. And who's the problem with these two? Oh, uh, probably the Kyoga, yeah. I mean, we just click Thunder again. I, I... Are you sure Kyoga should be going down this turn? If not, I'd be very surprised. But I feel like still having... Having another fake out, I feel could be good. Also because, like, it's not as good against this team, except for Sokoleo avoids. It's a nimble lion. I think it could be good against anything but the Kyoga. And I feel like his Kyoga is so low now. It's okay, and you brave it. Because again, like, that doesn't do a lot. And I was like, yeah. Sokoleo lives that. Sokoleo does not care. And on a good note, let me actually get Incineroar in again. We get Incineroar in again. Was that a smart thing? Yes, because we fake out the the thing. Actually, our Koga is dead. Our Koga is dead. But maybe it's better just to kill the Koga. I would assume. The fake out plus on steel strike would do enough. I would assume. Okay, you would draw into what? Paraform. Yeah, that lives it. That does live it. Sort of kind of makes me wish that I clicked. No, this you say fire. But it's in the rain. You're minus one. You don't burn me. You burn me. Dang it. Okay. I could have set up a trigger. Would that have helped here? I don't feel that it would particularly have done a big difference. Um. Okay. I could see him just trying to go for Tailwind again. I will... So it's just like you, and I will just flare blitz into Fairphone. Draw the Ho-Oh. The Kyoga is so far down that I feel like it should begin to kind of chip it down. Eh, yeah, probably won't do enough because we're burned. Maybe Superpower would have been the better then. Because we are dying to the Origin Pulses now. I think I try to want. I think I want to try to clear out with Z move for the next time. Not that it would have made any different than this. I mean, it would make it so that we could we could do stuff. Because right now we basically need him to miss. What's the biggest problem? The Ferrophone, right? Yeah, I guess it is. Yes, it is. Origin Pulse, miss! I don't know how, but this lion is so nimble. <laughs> okay. Crit! 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 No. Not even close. Okay. We okay, the parry. That was the strat. It wasn't, but I'll pretend like it was. Oh, Lisi, no, you don't be one of those people. Don't be one of those people. Okay, so it's gotten to it's gotten to the point. Well, 
where we are clicking Shiko on this Feral Fawn. And the best part is that we are landing it. That's the best part of this. Um, yeah, you can withdraw that. That's fine. Um, that's fine. Dang it. Oh, I just hoped. Oh, that would have been great. I did not have enough faith. Achikuno's dead. Achikuno's not dead. Okay. <laughs> oh, my Achikuno's not feeling too great here. Um, not feeling too great. Would you protect your Pharaoh Fawn? Yeah. We just do this. At least, at least take something down. Yeah, Pharaoh Fawn but sex. Okay, we did a good play. We did a good play. Um, we're faster than Ho-Ho. Oh. Atikuno, you awesome being. <laughs> I mean, still basically to win, we have to actually... We have to actually land a Shiko. That's what we have to live somehow and get the Kyogre down. Which basically means dodging attacks. Um, it does basically mean dodging attacks. Which I have faith. I have all the faith in the world right now that we can dodge. Don't have as much faith about living a thunder though. Which, like, that kind of ruined the dodging part of this game. Oh, we get to take the Koko down! Woo! That was a crit! <laughs> like, when you least need it is when you get it, basically. Okay. Gyro Ball. Can you not kill? No. You had to. Okay, so that was a bit of a... But I mean, we got it pretty close. It was looking horrendous and we got it pretty close. Ashkuna did not calm his mind enough to hit the tier call, but maybe next time. I mean, that would have been too cheeky, right? Getting in the two out of two times. Nah, shouldn't happen. Um, but with that, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Keep it cool. Bye.